I'm Ewan Kershaw. I'm here to basically get um, you guys ready for it. The comedy, yeah. <laughs> I like the way my girlfriend laughs the loudest there. <laughs> get me ready for it. <laughs> first act. Are you ready, first act? Yes. Well, go somewhere where you can actually get to the stage, my friend. Okay, first act is a wonderful, wonderful act. And um, so, Ram, you can start. Real life. Please welcome to the stage, Miss Christine Owen! Um, also, how do we feel about Northampton? Do we like Northampton? Yes! Are we proud of living in Northampton? Yes! Good! <laughs> well, that's, that's good. Um, that's good. I'm relieved to be here this evening because if I'm here, it means I'm not in my hometown. Um, my hometown is generally considered to be the roughest place on the planet. It's the place where I grew up, it's the place where I still live. Kench. Have anyone, has anyone heard of it? Yes. Yeah. I like to think of it as the great nation of Penge. Our administrative capital used to be Woolworths. It's now just a 99p shop. The... Penge is a town where these earrings are considered tiny. Hello, how are you doing? Are you alright? Oh, yes. Good, excellent. Fuck, how's loads of you? Now, before I begin, I just want to clear up a few questions that you might already have of me. I've already come up to stage and you've already gained some kind of opinion about me already. I just want to clear a few things up already. No, I'm not Jewish. Yes, from the back, it does look like I'm wearing a helmet. And no, I'm not Wolverine's autistic younger brother. I, I, I like having been born in Northampton. Touch me. That's good. See that? You know this thing that, uh, that thing? That's right. I quite like doing that at gigs ever since I got a review, right, and I'd done that. And the review said, Charlie Duncan comes on stage and starts fisting members of the audience. <laughs> You've got David Attenborough following people around with a camera crew there. He's like, and here, in amongst the pot noodles, and the alphabetic spaghetti, we see the urban council tenants. Latin name, Benefitus Dependentus. <laughs> I don't know if it's, it's sort of affecting my life. I do maybe have a bit of a chip on my shoulder about it. It's maybe quite a negative person, I think, generally. I'm quite a pessimistic person. I'm a glass half empty sort of guy. I always look on the dark side of every situation. My wife, on the other hand, is one of those annoyingly optimistic people. Always sees the silver lining behind every dark cloud always looking on the bright side. Even her blood group is B positive. That's, that's the sort of blood you want, isn't it? That's what you want coursing through your veins with every pulsing beat of her heart. B positive, B positive, B positive. That's what you want, isn't it, Northampton? My blood group is O, oh, shit. That's, that's so far. There's a lot of friendly faces here and we're a very welcoming town. Um, I've, uh, I have joined a lookalike agency, ladies and gentlemen. Tomorrow I'm opening a record shop as a fat Moby and, uh, and later in the week I'm at the blind school as McFly, which is... Uh, I'm going to play you a, a couple of songs, would that be okay? Brilliant. I can only, uh, only apologise for the guitar. Uh, my mum washed it. Uh, <laughs> and she was trying to help. Um, I don't know if you've had a similar experience to me, but um, particularly at Christmas when I was young, I was always made to kiss relatives I barely knew. Um, my parents actually used to take it one stage further and used to make me kiss strangers for money. Uh, in fact, my dad start, still can't look me in the face, but uh, that's cataracts. So, uh, so this is not a wholly pleasant song. I'm not going to lie to you, ladies and gentlemen. But this is about being eight years old and being made to kiss relatives. Okay. You hear that? Yeah. kiss my grand She's got no teeth and she smells of piss <laughs> Don't make me kiss my grand She uses her tongue and really goes for it <laughs> Give me granddaddy's alright 
sneaks in my room in the middle of the night. It's our secret. <laughs> Give me Uncle Pete. Makes me watch him touching sheep, but he's not my grand. I love ya. Don't make me kiss my grand. Her beard's beginning to cut my face. <laughs> Don't make me kiss my gran Her back has burst and there's stuff all over the place Join your crisps <laughs> Give me carrots, give me sprouts No one listens to my shouts Please help me I don't mean to be a pain I just don't want another infection in my mouth again <laughs> Thank you.